Hello and welcome to our channel. This is a video from the Odoo School Management System series. This video is about subjects management. If you haven't subscribed yet, click on the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to make sure you will be notified of our next video. The subject is a core area of any school. Every class or course has subjects. These subjects are taught by faculties and are assigned to a specific course, faculty and a batch. The following details will be required to define a subject. Name. Code. Type. Subject type. Grade weightage and parent subject. Number 1. Name. A subject requires a meaningful name. For example, piano for kids. Number 2. Subject code. A short code for the subject is defined with a predefined pattern. Number 3. Type. A type has three values. They are theory, practical, and both. Number 4. Subject type. A subject type can be used to define to be either compulsory or elective. Number 5. Grade weightage. This will be a value to scale the grade. Finally, parent subject. We can assign another subject to be treated as a parent subject. This is optional. One thing to remember. It is a best practice to follow a standard coding system to keep consistent definitions. A code also helps to easily identify the subject. Now we have all the information to proceed. So let's see how to create a subject. Go to the ERP core module, then configuration menu, then subjects, under the subject management section. You will see all the subjects if subjects already exist. Otherwise, a blank screen is shown. Click on the Create button to start creating a new subject. Enter a suitable name for the subject, let's say Piano for Kids. Now, enter the code. Select the type, let's say it's a practical subject. Now select the subject type. Let's say, it's an elective subject. Grade weightage and parent subject fields are optional. You can leave it blank, if you want. Now click on the save button. Click on subjects to go back to the previous screen. You can see the newly created subject on the list. If you cannot see, type the search term piano in the search bar and press the enter key. The system will search and filter your records. If you want to edit the record, just click on it to open. Then click on the edit button. Make any changes and click on the save button again to save the changes. See the logs on the right, it writes all major transaction details as a record. You also can add your own log notes. Click on subjects to go back to the previous screen. You can see the updated subject details on the bottom. That concludes this tutorial. Watch our next video regarding another feature in Odoo School ERP. If you have questions, please leave a comment below. If you want to read a step-by-step -step guide, please visit our blog. The link is included in the video description. You also can visit our knowledge forum to post your questions and find answers. Until we meet again, goodbye.